Hey guys, it's Stefan from Chichul Australia and welcome to Update. As of post date May 16th, 2013, Apple has released the new iTunes 11.0.3 with major inclusions to Mini Player. As we can go through the dots here, Mini Player includes a beautiful new view that showcases your album artwork. In addition, a progress bar is now built in. Improve Songs Views. You can now enjoy your album artwork while in Songs View. And for a long-awaited update for people who still import their CDs to iTunes, multiple disc configuration, which means they will now appear as a single album as they were meant to be viewed. Basically, when you insert two CDs to import, they can now be appeared as a single album rather than two separate discs. This is great for people who still like to import their CDs. Also provides performance improvements when searching and sorting large iTunes libraries as well as security. Now, if we hop over to the right hand side, we can go through some specifics. So the post date, May 16th. The file size for OS X is 187 megabytes and for Windows it drops down to about 80 megabytes. The, stis, the system requirements, Mac OS X version 10.6.8 or later and the Windows XP service pack 2 or later, 32 bit and 32 bit Windows 7, Vista and Windows 8. And you can also download it for 64 bit on a different link. Now, we can go through the mini player now once we hop out. And we can have a look. So I've got a song playing here. So if you want to head into mini player, you go over to the right and click the little tab and that will switch to a mini player. So as you can see here, the new update includes this new album view. You can now check your album artwork out while you're using the mini player basically. And to switch back to the normal mini player, you just go with these two arrows and it turns back into the mini player. As you can see here, the progress bar is the new update. You can go from side to side like you would in the major iTunes. As always, the song changes and when you go back on to the bar, you can use your configurations with the play, pause and the drag. So that's the main update to iTunes as well as security enhancements and as well as the multi-disc improvements. Long awaited for some people, so hopefully this answers your prayers of having one single album. So if you enjoyed this update, please leave a comment on how you like the new 11.0.3 iTunes. And if you like this tutorial and update, please subscribe and share and let people know I'm back to making tutorials and updates and reviews. So thanks for watching guys and happy iTunes.